Police on the Big Island say a man there has died from a 4th of July fireworks accident. Manolo Morales reports. Big Island police have identified the man who died as 20-year-old Glenn John Nakata. Police say officers and fire department personnel responded to a possible illegal fireworks call around 10.30 p.m. on July 4th in a retail parking lot along Kamaka Eha Avenue. It's just a uh, vacant parking lot. We do believe that uh, there were multiple individuals there uh, during the incident. Um, uh, celebrating 4th of July. Police believe Nakata was possibly holding an aerial firework, which is illegal. Witnesses reported that he was holding the firework above his head. Um, shortly thereafter, he was uh, observed on the ground uh, within uh, what, what appeared to be an injury on his head. Nakata was taken by ambulance to the Kona Community Hospital, where he later died. It's just, just a really sad, sad event. And very unfortunate that it happened. And Again, our family, yeah, hearts go out to the family members and uh, his friends and, and people like that. Mayor Mitch Roth points out there's a good reason why aerial fireworks are illegal. We see people getting injured every year and, you know, we try to put out messages warning people about these kinds of things. And, you know, people think, oh, it's never going to happen to me, but... It can, it can happen to anyone. Police have launched an investigation and ordered an autopsy to determine the exact cause of death. Anyone who witnessed the incident is asked to call police. Manolo Morales, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.